Charles Stuart Parnell, nicknamed the Chief, the uncrowned King of Ireland. By far, Charles Stuart Parnell was the most outstanding politician in modern Irish history. He outclasses O'Connell, and no one in the 20th century came even close. Charles Stuart Parnell went into politics in the mid-70s. He opposed British rule and wanted the total land reform. As a pr Protestant born in County Wicklow, he was part of the old Irish Anglo ascendancy. He owned and managed a huge estate called Avondale in the County of Wicklow. And he was also half American. His mother was from New Jersey and he, he spent two years in the United States in the 1870s with his brother. While there, he did not associate with the Irish American community. He spoke with an English accent, the kind of man who pronounced Ireland as Ireland. He was very reserved and standoffish. He did not talk about his money. Charles Stuart Parnell was very much for the home rule policy. The home, rule, the home rule definition was all domestic policies in Ireland would come under an elected Irish legislature and be executed under the British Parliament and government. Charles Stuart Parnell then led, then turned to organizing the Irish MPs and members of Parliament. This led to an overthrow of Isaac Butt in 1879 and the formation of the tightly controlled Nationalist Party in the British House of Commons called the Irish Parliamentary Party or the IPP. As many citizens opposed home rule throughout Ireland, Parnell tried to stress that it was not making a mockery of British rule. Finally, the time has come. In 1886, the home rule bill was proposed. Gladstone spoke for about five hours. It split his own Liberal Party. Followers of the radical Joseph Chamberlain broke away as the Liberal Unionist and brought the government down. Join the Conservatives. As a good friend of Parnell, Gladstone's first home rule bill failed. His government fell and there was a general election in which home rule was the main issue. But then controversy arose. While trying to get the home rule set in Ireland, Parnell had an affair with Gladstone's wife, Kitty O'Shea, and lived with her in London where they had three children. This was of course looked down upon in all of the community and it was just a mockery just to even think that someone like Parnell could do this to someone like a good friend like Gladstone. They were both going for the same issue and now they are facing something much even worse. This became a sensational scandal. Gladstone and his liberals abandoned Parnell because strict attitudes among liberal voters had arose. The Catholic Church then pounced had never liked Parnell and now condemned him for his unquote unquote sins. Towards the end of all of this mess, the Irish Parliamentary Party split into Parliament and anti-Parliament factions. The Home Rule Bill was never passed.